There you go, Sponge. I cannot speak. Uh... Yeah, so I'm playing Cosmo Admiral Dreadnoughts. I'm just slowly going through some of these options. I will go for we'll go through that. Just get a few videos in. Uh, yeah, let's go. I want to get a decent, like I want decent uh, spotting capabilities. Funnels. I think we can just go with the. Yes, yeah, so I think we'll just do the triple funnel. Barbettes we don't yet have. Centerline guns. I think there's no real need for a 13 inch gun because, uh, yeah, reloads have 92.8 compared to 50. Like compared to like 60 seconds or what's it for this? Uh, yeah, so it's, it's worth getting the 12 inch, I feel. And we want relatively good arcs of fire. Secondary, I mean, do, do we have any rooms for the secondary or anything like that? No. Two inch. Ooh, how big can I put? No, four inch, no, three inch, no. Well, okay then, we're, we're putting the two inch up there. Uh, doubt it's going to do much use. Uh, we could put torpedoes, but I think those are going to be pointless. Six inch barrels. Uh, yeah, I'm going to want those... At least in these positions. Okay. I'm literally just saying where I can put them. Because in the end, if it comes down to it, I can, uh... Yeah, the ship is overweight. I mean, we can... Just make it a bit chunkier, heavier in the water, which is... Fine. Yeah, just... There we go. Uh, steam steering semi-balanced. Got... Yeah, I think we would just go with semi-balanced. Call fuel, we can't put in juiced. Uh, compound. That's going to put us away. We don't really need it, we're fighting against. Citadel, that's also going to put us away. Standard bulkheads. Single hull, yeah. Can I go enhanced? How much? Okay, so. Since we don't really need that much protection. Ooh, actually, that may let us get slightly heavier armor. Can we get a compound in? No. Without Citadel and compound? No. Let's say with Iron Plate and a Citadel. And we've got... We'll build one part if we have a decent amount of money left over, so I'm going to put that into... Uh, the height of the hull greatly affects the ship. The taller is less stable shooting platform. Something is flooding with the operational range. Okay, that's fine. We can go back. There we go. That's perfect. That's given us everything we really need at the moment. So we'll. I mean, we should easily be able to take it out. That's an interesting layout. 
Oh, he's got torpedo tubes, I think, in the front. Oh, there's a torpedo incoming. I have auto steering. Yeah. Yeah, the torpedo missed. Oh yeah, he's taken some heavy damage. Yeah, he's got a salvo of six inch shells coming in. He did lay smoke, which is... Oh, so it's the light cruiser Roland. I mean, we've done a lot more damage to him than he has to us. Okay. Boom, boom. Okay. That missed. That missed. Though there's some heavy weaponry coming in. The three inch guns, obviously. Wait. Oh no, that's the Roland. Yeah, our three inches aren't firing yet. There we go. Oh, we. Oh no! Oh no, we did it. We took a tiny bit of damage. Oh no. Okay, he took some damage to the rudder. Annoyed. Well, now our two inches are going to open up, I think. Yep. There we go. Ooh, we took a bit of damage there. Boom, boom. Hmm. I'm worried about it. He's done a lot of damage to her. We're eating that torpedo and I'm not happy about it. Yep, that did a lot of damage. Where we are. Our main guns are very likely to land hits. There we go. Mm. 
There we go. We are taking on a lot of water. Ooh. He had a magazine go up. Yep. His magazine went off. So that's what that pillar of uh, fire is. So yeah, guys. I'm about to try to up this, uh, what's it called? Yeah, we did take a lot of flooding. Uh, yeah. Pop 20. Jesus Christ. Yeah, uh, goodbye. Oh, that was my dad, my dad, my dad, my dad.